Hi everyone and welcome to the next spotter. So all of you are aware of the 7 to 11 series that we are conducting today under this spotter fest and this happens to be the fourth spotter. There's another one that will be following at 11 o'clock which will wrap up the day that is the plan for today and then we'll have a similar series tomorrow as well. So the spotter that we have is a spotter which I've kept for the second year students and I think once you look at it, it's something which you'll never forget and that is uh, you can see that this is an organ which they've opened up and it's got these multiple pearly white cysts of variable sizes. Uh, some are really small, some are bigger, they are pearly white so obviously they are filled with some material and when they saw that cyst, when they saw the cyst wall under the microscope, this is the appearance that they got. Also, when they examined the fluid, this is a structure that they noticed. So the first thing that we see are a lot of pearly white cysts. Apart from that, we can see that uh, the wall over here, the cyst wall that we are highlighting over here, it gives a classical paint brush appearance as if you've taken a brush and there's a stroke of paint that has been made. That is the cyst wall. We are obviously talking about hydrated cyst as of now. And all of you know hydrated cyst is caused by kinococcus granulosis, the dog tapeworm. So hydrated cyst, the cyst wall has a paint brush appearance and the fluid inside these cysts, they have hooklets. Everyone can visualize these hooklets really well and these hooklets are acid fast so means they are going to stain with ZN stain. They are acid fast. So just a quick recap. These are the extremely pearly white variable sized cysts. Second, this is the classical paint brush appearance that we see of the cyst wall and third this is the higher part of the hooklet that you can notice which is stained with a special stain that is known as ZN stain. So well that was the spotter that we discussed right now and now the last one will be coming up exactly in an hour that is at 11 o'clock which will wrap it up for the day. Hope you are enjoying the spotter series and also if there's any other feedback do let me know. Apart from that I also hope you are following the morning 7.30 AM classes. The class for tomorrow will be on the YouTube channel Wednesday class and I'm hoping to see all of you in that as well.